Okay, here I have a cubby set. I made the uh, cubby out of uh, wire mesh and just gathered up uh, leaves from under some trees around here and covered it up. Actually, you can see right through it, didn't close the back up. I've done, I've closed the back in years past this year, decided to leave it open. Have uh, my own uh, beaver deer mix uh, as far as bait. Uh, and to that uh, beaver and deer meat, I added Locklear's uh, bait solution and did that in 2014. So it is uh, two years old. The trap, I have it set back 16 inches from the opening. I had uh, a couple years ago, not in this particular uh, one, but another set that I used to wire a cubby, I had the trap tight against the hole, had a cat walk right up, step on the edge of the jaw, and then proceeded to walk all over the cubby and so forth, and the reason I knew this was there was snow. So snow gives you a lot of help and so forth. Okay, checked a few other sets on the way. This is the last one I have in here. Again, it's cubby using the wire. I just used some pine browse that covered up. Again, you can basically see through it. Traps out, again, about 16 inches. Have uh, blocking on the side, but uh, didn't have any activity. It's next to, there's a deer trail comes through here, so. A lot of times you'll have, uh, you know, bobcats, fisher, coyotes will follow them. So this is right off of this. It's right off a of logging road here. Well, that's all we have today. It's uh, Christmas Eve, December 24th. Ah, uh, one other thing. Uh, again, the bait was my homemade uh, beaver and deer with the Locklear uh, bait solution. I'm using a uh, cat collar off uh, to the side of the uh, cubby, have it smeared on the uh, little hemlock, and then I use the film canister, have it full of uh, sheep wool, and put some uh, cronks, all gash lure on that as a draw and also had uh, one of the previous sets I didn't do it to all of them I went to do it today and this, I needed to take it into a warm area but I had some uh, skunk and I need to uh, sort of get it more liquefied it's been in the back of my truck and with a colder temperature it uh, solidified and uh, or saw it up but uh, on one of the lower ones I did have uh, that on also give it a skunky smell